Plasma is blowing up and it's the talk of town for anybody that got into the pre-sale. Huge congratulations seeing over a 200x which is insane and this is just the start. In this video we're going to go over what Plasma is, what XPL is, the price prediction for XPL and the enormous achievements they have already pulled off and everything you need to know about Plasma. So they are seeking to provide infrastructure built specifically for stable coins. Plasma is a high performance layer one blockchain purpose built for stable coins. And honestly, they've done an amazing job already landing top 10 in blockchains. And you can see in terms of TVL actually. So they have $2.5 billion in TVL the first day that they have launched. In terms of layer one blockchain tokens, they are 49th place right now. So it actually has a lot of room for them to grow. They can get into the top 10 blockchains if they can pull off everything you know that they have planned. And that's looking at a 5 to 10x. If they get into the top 10, they'll be seeing a 10x in terms of market cap trading at just $2.1 billion and the top 10 would put them at $27 billion and maybe they can move up to top five which would be huge that would be a 50x and let's get into what Plasma is so you can understand it a little bit more. As I mentioned, it is a layer one focused just on stablecoin payments. It's often described as a stablecoin infrastructure for instant payments. You have a thousand plus transactions per second. You have free USDT transfers. So the bottleneck with a lot of blockchains are you need a native gas token. When people are, you know, exploring on, let's say, Ethereum or other other chains, even Solana or other L2 chains, Linea, Arbitrum, Optimism, most people are not aware that you need a gas token, which is the native token for that chain. With Plasma, it is totally free. So you can do USDT transfers for free and use other gas tokens on their chain. It is, of course, EVM compatible and they have a native Bitcoin bridge so you could leverage your Bitcoin and start earning rewards and they also have a, a lot of cool um, features verticals they have a credit card launching earning 4% cash back 150 countries covered and then a 10% yield and of course this is just you know the, the start of what they're trying to pull off. I was super impressive for them to launch with a $2.5 billion TVL and they're aiming to bring trillions on chain. It's their mission and unlocking a programmable, a programmable money layer. Unlike general purpose blockchains, it integrates stablecoin features at the protocol level. And as I mentioned, it's free to do USDT transfers. And you could dive into the documents to understand what Plasma is all about. You know, all the technical stuff, the Plasma BFT, if you're into that, the execution, the gasless stablecoin transfers, all the security. But we're going to go over the tokenomics. I think that's what most people um, really care about. So their native token, as ETH is the native token for Ethereum, sold for Solana, you get the point, is XPL. And XPL did some major moves. It was trading uh, pre-market at 50 cents. Pre-sailers that got into the pre-sale either through Plasma or Echo, they got in for, I believe, 5 cents. And other people got airdrops. They got in extremely early. I think on Echo, I saw people pulled off over a 200x, $1,000 to 200k. Honestly, it doesn't get better than that, especially since we're still extremely early. So this was the launch day yesterday. It was trading at about 75, yeah, 70 cents at the lowest, we'll say. And it did a 100% move to $1.50 at the top. Right now, we're seeing a retrace for $1.22. Here would naturally be great support for it to come into the $1.80 region. Or even a dollar is usually a psychological zone, a huge round area. Everybody's either taking profits or buying at that area. So it did 
huge gains and i think a lot of liquidity went from other popular coins everybody was making gains on aster we did a video on aster which was uh, extremely profitable into xpl because just the strength the backers the hype and of course the technology um, so let's go back into the tokenomics so you could understand xpl so we're building a foundational infrastructure for new global financial systems where money moves at internet speed with zero fees full transparency our goal is to bring trillions of dollars on chain unlocking an open programmable layer for money itself XPL is the core asset securing the system just as sovereign currencies and central banks reserves underpin traditional finance. XPL safeguards the integrity of this new system and aligns long-term incentives as stablecoin adoption scales. XPL is the native token of the Plasma blockchain. It is used to facilitate transactions as well as to reward those who provide network support by validating transactions. XPL is similar in the way Bitcoin on the Bitcoin blockchain or Ethereum on the ETH blockchain work. So let's look into the distribution. There's 10 billion XPL at mainnet beta launch, and you can see the distribution in the breakdown. Public sale got 10%, investors 25%, ecosystem and growth 40%. We have the team at 25%. And then the public sale, people who weren't in the U.S. got 100% of their tokens fully unlocked. But if you are a U.S. citizen, then you actually are subject to a 12-month lockup. You can see the vesting periods for all the other tokens right here. And you can see how long they're vested for, when they're going to be unlocked. So you might see some dumps or people taking profits because they're extremely in the money. And then, of course, the inflation schedule and all that great stuff. Let's jump back to Plasma and take a look into it a bit more. As, I, as I've mentioned a few times, zero fee USDT transfers, which is huge. Custom gas tokens to simplify the user experience. Plasma enables transaction fees to paid in whitelist assets such as USD and BTC. Confidential payments, which is huge. Sending payments without revealing private transactions. They have so many different verticals. They have the credit card coming out. They have the one app coming out. They are in about a hundred different uh, countries. One billion dollars in stablecoin deposits. Fifteen supported stablecoins. The sixth network by USDT balance, maybe the sixth uh, largest holder and then 50 plus partnerships all over the world and you can see them for yourself. So they've done an amazing job right off the bat and if you wanna actually access Plasma, you can go to Stargate and bridge over. It's extremely easy. I'm gonna show you guys how to do it. So we're gonna do um, just a little bit. Let's see if we can do $7 of Plasma. You know, just a small transaction to show you guys how it's done so what we're going to do is bridge over from the ethereum blockchain to the plasma blockchain and buy uh, xpl so i still think we're extremely early you can take a look at all the fees there's a small price impact right here i'm losing 40 cents about five percent um, there are probably better ways to do it like buying spot in an exchange and then withdrawing it or sending usdt over to the plasma network so now you can see I have $6.24 in Plasma. We got a little bit of XPL. We are rich. Let's go back to Plasma. Let's open up the app. And you can see here, you're able to start earning XPL uh, immediately by depositing into these partners right now. Let's go back actually and check out our portfolio. We have 6.25 Plasma. Here's the bridge and you can directly go from Plasma and actually bridge pretty much from any chain to Plasma. The same with swaps, here are all their partners. And if you want, you could start earning right now 32% APY. You could deposit into it with stable coins. Um, extremely easy to do so on either ETH or the Plasma network. So you can earn 32% APY as of right now. That's quite high. And then they have a basis trading vault coming as well. So it's still extremely early. Plasma launched yesterday. The price is insane, um, which if we're thinking that this could do a 10x from a dollar 24, that would be approximately $12. So if you just zoom out and you 
we have a target of $12 and like I said that would be plasma going into the top 10 it's currently sitting at 49 in terms of layer 1 blockchains but you have Cardano, Tron uh, which I think could get replaced by something like plasma especially with the huge partnerships backers huge community and success they've already pulled off right now it's extremely impressive on what they've done and i still think it's extremely early for stable coins we've seen things like the genius act regulation and uh, uh, they say it themselves bringing trillions onto the chain and i think plasma is going to pull it off if you have any questions post them below Hit that subscribe button and we're going to bring you guys opportunities every single day. So don't miss out. I'll see you guys tomorrow.